Okay, so by now you have your domain, your hosting, and WordPress all set up. So now you have a site and your know, WordPress is on there, you have a blog with nothing on it. So what you need to do now is you need to purchase this theme. So I'll attach the link below. And the reason we use this is, you know, there's a few reasons. It's a very nice layout and also, you know, for the main reason, it converts better with AdSense, you know, better than most themes out there. I haven't tested that many, but, you know, we've been using this one since, you know, for a year now. And it's been getting us consistent results, you know, 3 to 5% click-through rates. So it's perfect. So that's why I need you to buy this theme. And, you know, just click Add to Cart and go through the whole process and, you know, just purchase it. Now, once you've purchased it, I think I'm just going to go to my downloads. It should be here. So I have newspaper here. And this is the theme. So what you need to do is just download it. And you, once you download it, you're going to get... um. A zip file so all files and documentation is perfect but what you can do is just download the installable WordPress file only so you're gonna get a zip file here okay this is the theme and also this the license certificate and purchase code okay now with this you're gonna use this to um, you know activate your theme so you know once you have it and um, you're gonna come so you see I've already got newspaper set up but what you need to do is you just come on where's it going appearance click on themes now click on add new upload theme and then you can choose file and now the file is gonna be the zip file you just downloaded um so it would be this don't know what happened there it did it twice Okay then. There you go, and you just click install now. And I don't know what's gonna happen because I've already got it. And I'm trying to install it again, which is a stupid idea, but just to show you, <laughs> I'm doing it. Okay, see, Steam install failed because destination folder already exists. I already have it. But yeah, once you have got it, you're gonna come on here. Um. Okay, once you come on here, I believe. I'm just seeing. So yeah, once you set it up, you know, I think when you go on the site, you'll be able to. It'll have a top bar at the top, and it'll ask you to activate it. But um, otherwise, you probably come in here and you know, click on theme details or something. I have no idea. But because I've completely forgot, you know, I've set this up a few times, but I always get my team to set this up for me. Anyways, once you download the theme, you know, you'll, you'll quickly see when you come on here, it'll be here somewhere, and it'll tell you to insert your activation code. Once you insert your activation code, you know, the theme is activated, but normally you don't even need your activation code once you have the downloadable file. You just download this, install it, and boom, you know, your, um, your theme will be, will be set up, and you will see this, this newspaper, all of this. And when you go to the site, it's going to have a layout kind of like this. It's just going to be a bit more hectic. See, I've got content up already on this. But it's going to be a bit more hectic than this. All right, that's it for this video. In the next video, we're actually going to be going over all the settings you need to make to make sure you know your website is set up perfectly. All right, see you in the next video.